Moinsen, this is Sebastian. My brother just got married, so quite obviously I needed a wedding gift. Of course, I could not just present him with a traditional gift, but instead, especially in COVID times when maybe not every friend can attend, I went for a digital guest book. The idea is this, the guests, as well as anyone who received the link, can visit a domain I registered for this occasion. There, they type in their name and a message, and after picking a font and drawing some decoration, they submit it to the guest book, where it is displayed as part of a loop of randomly selected messages from all guests. The display is a 7.inch e-paper display held by the initials of bride and groom. It is lit by a short strip of RGB LEDs that can be addressed individually. The case has been 3D printed and, to be honest, has not been designed too well as I ran out of time. Instead everything has just been pushed into the base with an USB cable going to the outside where the thing can be powered with about 500mA from any USB port, so I could use a simple power bank on the wedding to run it for many hours. The Brains is an ESP32, which connects to a list of preset Wi-Fi's, including the one at the wedding location, and my phone's hotspot as a fallback. Once online, the device keeps polling new messages that are downloaded and stored locally, so they continue to be shown even if the device loses Wi-Fi connection. It even runs a small web server, so I can send some control commands to clear all stored images in case I have to fix a problem during the wedding. Of course, there are many details to this project, like the website to create messages, my method to compress the images in order to fit hundreds of them into the ESP's memory, or the exact wiring. If you want to know the details, visit my blog at There Ought to Be by following the link in the video description. Be warned that some of the project interiors tend to be a bit ugly as I ran out of time, so if you want to build something similar yourself, you probably need to fix and modify a few things, but all the code is there. So, that's it for this video, see you on my blog, ciao! Thank you.